What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking on my video. If you're new to this channel, my name is Andrea and I do different types of videos like vlogs, clothes reviews, makeup reviews. So consider subscribing and click that notification bell so you don't miss any of my future videos. In today's video, I got a huge box from Sephora. So I want to review and let you know what I received. So if you're interested, keep on watching. So I got this huge box in the mail, but I only ordered a few items. Like I don't understand why they send a huge box in the mail when there's only one, two, three, four, five. There's only six items in there. What's the need for this humongous box? You get so happy when you see a huge box and then you open it and it's just like two items in there. Whatever. Let's review the items that I got. Oof, it's hot in here. I, let's start off with hair products because I was in need of hair products and I came across this bundle. I was, I only get the Beach Club. This is from IG, IGK and it's the Styling Essentials. I have gotten a few products from them and they're pretty good. Oh, these are like smaller than like the travel size I didn't expect them to be this tiny but anyway I have used the Beach Club one and it just gives you it smells really good by the way it gives you like like beachy waves oh, it smells so good once I uh, blow dry my hair I put this on and it gives you like this really nice texture to it I also have tried I've not tried the good behavior one. So this I have not tried. This I'm excited to try. This one is bigger than the Beach Waves one. And then I've tried their, their dry shampoo. This is the first class IGK dry shampoo, which is the same size as Beach Club. So I'm excited for this one. This one is just a smoothing spray, 24 hours frizz control. I guess this is just hairspray. So hairspray, dry shampoo, and then waves for after you do your blow dry. So that is it for hair. No, I'm lying. That is not it for hair. I also got, also from IGK, two additional products that I have not tried yet. So I'm um, really excited to give this a try. This one is a Thirsty Girl Coconut Milk Leave-In Conditioner, 24 hours frizz control. It's also a spray. Put this on when you wash your hair before you style it um, and it's supposed to be a leave-in conditioner so it gets your hair soft and ready for styling. Another one that I'm interested in trying is the IGK Mistress Hydring Hair, <laughs> Hydring hair Balm and this is, I'm supposed to put this on, so it's a gel. And it doesn't really have smell to it. Actually, actually it does. It feels like coconut milk. Coconut milk. It's like a coconut feel. It's, everything smells. Everything smells very clean, which is why I really like their product. I'm not sure what this is supposed to do, um, but I think it's supposed to keep your hair. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, with coconut oil. That's what says. That's what smells like coconut oil. Leave-in conditioning balm won't weight hair down. If you have dry, coarse, frizzy hair, you want soft, hydrating hair. So I'm guessing. Okay, let's try this because my hair is looking a little bit frizzy right now. So I'm guessing it's like a gel because it feels a little bit like a gel but it's not sticky so it feels it feels good i mean i love all their products so i'm sure it's going to work but once i use these products i'll let you guys know how it went and if i recommend it if you need it 
this one for sure, for sure, for sure, I love and I recommend. It just gives the texture if you want the texture to your hair. And this one is just a dry shampoo. It's, it's just a dry shampoo. I'm pretty sure you can go to CVS, Rite Aid, Twin Beat and get a dry shampoo. It does the same thing. Moving on. Okay, so that's really it for hair products. Moving on, I got a Sephora Favorites Give Me Shine lip kit so I was gonna get I think it was a lipstick then I came across this kit that came with like all the favorite brands of lip gloss and I said hey, let me try it it comes with the Lancome Juicy Tube the Patrick Guitar Fenty Beauty what is this one this one's pretty Oh, this is NARS. And then the last one is the um, Too Faced Lip Injection. I think that one just came out. So it comes out with one, two, three, four, five. It comes up with five products. I will be posting the I will be posting the prices on the side because I don't have them with me right now. The invoices just say like the SKU numbers and the uh, UPC with their names, but no prices. So I don't remember what will this cost. I'll be putting everything down here somewhere for you guys. So the Lancome Juicy Tube original. Let's see. I guess this is just like comes with a regular tube. Just like this. It smells very fruity, which I like. It's um, it's glossy, but it's very sticky. It's like tacky. So it feels like a lip gloss you would wear when you were a kid. So definitely not comfortable. If you see my previous videos, you know that things on my lips bother me. That's why I usually stick with like makeup pencils instead of lipsticks and if I do wear lipsticks they don't last very long because it bothers me so this right now I'm probably giving this away to Brianna because I'm not going to be using it and I need to take this off now it's not pleasant <laughs> it doesn't feel good it's very that's why I like you guys, that's why I like buying these small kits because you get to try the product before you buy the original size. And if you don't like it, it's fine. Like it wasn't that expensive and you could just like give it away to somebody or something. The next one is Patrick Ta. Um, I love the packaging. It's very, it's cute. I love the color of it. It's like a rose gold. I love the color of the lip gloss itself. Hopefully, Oh, I still feel it. Hopefully it's not that consistency that the other one was. Let's see. This spoolie is really tiny, which I like. Mm. It doesn't really have a scent. I don't know if I'm just smelling my hair part, but this one might have a little tiny scent but it's not that noticeable this one feels good and i feel a little bit of a minty feel to it which i like to feel when i put lip gloss on this one feels nice is is when i rub my lips together it feels smooth it doesn't feel heavy or tacky so this one I give it a yes, Patrick Ta. Patrick Ta. It's called Major Glow and it's a lip shine. So it's not really noticeable. I mean, it's just like a shine to it. They don't really have colors to it, but I like it. It's Fenty Beauty. Let's see, this is also a really nice lip gloss and it's big for a. Look how much of a difference this is. So, this is a pretty 
pretty big size and if you look at that inside of the product it looks like it brings a lot of product now this does look like it comes with a color so let's see this is a color fussy hopefully it's nice because that's because <laughs> I'm liking the color I see the appetizer is also small but it's way bigger than Patrick Ta I'll show you so this is the Fenty applicator and this is the Patrick Ta Patrick Ta alright so let's hold this one yeah So it, I like this one as well. It's smooth, it gives it shine, and it gives it a little bit of color. It's not too strong, but I really, I really like this one, you guys, because it's it gives it a tiny bit of color. It's not crazy color. It's very soft on the lips, and it gives it a really nice shine. So, it's not like crazy color, but it's enough if you just want like a little tape of color. <laughs> but um, yeah, I really like it. So, Fenty Beauty. I think this is the first Fenty Beauty product I've ever tried. I haven't tried any of the Fenty Beauties. Maybe I should go out and buy some Fenty Beauty. If you guys have tried Fenty Beauty, let me know in the comments down below. Let me know if you guys like it, what products you like, what products works for you. No. So the, again, this is a color fuss. I really like it and it's not uncomfortable. So you can wear it for a while and it's not going to be uncomfortable for you. The next one up is the NARS, which looks like a lipstick. Yeah, it, I don't know what this is. Lipstick? Let's see. It's a full size. Okay, so this one is a full size. The Fenty is also full size, which is why the um, the size. But let's see. This is oh, it's a lip balm. So it's an afterglow lip balm. So you guys, I still feel the tackiness from the first one. It's not good. Sorry, Lancome. All right. Anyway. This is a very pretty color. It's pink. If you guys are into pink, it looks like it's very subtle. This is in color orgasm. So let's see. Let's see. Yeah. This feels nice, you guys. Like it feels like a lip balm, not a lip gloss. So it feels really nice. It doesn't really have any color to it, to be honest with you. I don't really see anything. There's really no color to it. It might be a little tiny bit of pink, but it's not that noticeable. It's not that noticeable at all. But it feels nice on your lips, like when your lips are really dry and you feel like you need to put something on. This would swimming in. All right you guys and the last product of this kit is the Too Faced lip injection and this is the extreme Did even... and I believe this is a new one I'm not sure if they have other products but I know they just came out with a lip injection so I was I was really excited to try this to be honest with you the reason why I bought this whole thing was because of this Too Faced lip injection because I've been seeing good reviews on it so See, this is a lip gloss. Um, it goes on really clear, so there's no color. The smell, it's fruity. It feels really nice on the lips, and very feels good, very smooth. This is a instant and long-term lip. Plumper. So let's see. It 
so far not pumping. It doesn't have a color, so. Okay, I'm starting to feel tingle. I feel a little bit of tingle, but not that much. So let's move on. So for the products, I honestly liked all of them, but I wasn't a fan. Um the Lancome Juicy Tube. No. I, unless you want to give it to your two-year-old, <laughs> um, no, it's very ugh. They like it. Put this aside. The next, oh, next this is this new sticks. I saw this in review on YouTube, and I was so intrigued. Hello. So you guys, I just did reviews on so many products and I wasn't recording so let me try this one more time so I um, did the review on this nude stick and how cool this is that it comes with a little first of all this is a blush this is a blush, but you can also put it on your eyelids and you can put it on your lips and um, yeah, so you practically pat it on. Putting this on on my cheek. I tried it with the with the brush, but it didn't really feel that comfortable. It just feels like I'm rubbing my skin. Um, but it feels very soft, so you might give it a try. I did like the color of it. Um, for the lips, I did try it on my lips. I wasn't crazy about it. Um, the color is just not for me. Crazy about the lips, but I really like it for the cheeks and the eyes. It's very easy um, if you're on the go. So just put it on your eyelids, rub it on. And your cheeks is perfect to just throw in your bag comes with this little tin and the little tin comes with the mirror so it's perfect I love it um you could also put something else in here maybe like a lip gloss or something and it's just like this in your bag and ready to go I also reviewed Patrick Ta this is a major glow Patrick Ta for the face and it's a highlighting mist I sprayed on myself thinking that it was a setting spray and I didn't feel anything so it's like let me show you guys see it's like a little highlighter because it feels it doesn't feel like when you spray setting spray that you feel like the mist of the water and it feels refreshing and great when I first sprayed this on my face I just felt like air so I was a little confused with that but I definitely like it it gives it a little glow I'm definitely gonna keep reviewing this and I'll let you guys know how this goes because I don't really see on my face like a difference when it comes to glow because I did put a little bit of highlighter but that was before um, and I was just telling you guys how I love fans so much because I get so hot in the summertime I was showing you guys that I had one that my sister had given me like 11 years ago and I still have it my daughter brought me one from Spain because she knows I can just throw this one in my bag and just like find myself and another one from an arcade so yeah I have my little collection of fans so when I came across this I was like yeah I have to have it it's so cute and it's tiny it's tiny so I could just put this in my bag and I'm ready to go and yeah you guys that is it for my haul I hope you liked it if you did please give it a thumbs up leave a comment let me know what works for you if this was helpful in any way Again, you guys, thank you so much for watching and I will see you on my next video. Bye!